guess from your point of view, just good to be back on the pitch. Yeah, that's the main thing for me, you know, getting back on the pitch was seemed like it was never going to happen and um, you know, for us to pick up two results like we have in them two games is, is even better. Like, you know, you miss that winning feeling and, and even just playing and when you get the winning feeling as well, it's like, you know, there's no other feeling really, but yeah, no, it's great. Yeah, and how do you feel after that? I mean, two games in quick succession. Um, honestly, after the game on Sunday, it felt like I'd been hit by a train. <laughs> it was ridiculous. I've only trained three days before that as well, and they've all been on AstroTurf, which has not helped. And then um, we had the one day off, well, recovery, and then um, I really didn't think I'd be able to get through Tuesday, an hour, let alone the whole game. And uh, yeah, needless to say, yesterday and today I'm feeling it, but you know, the uh, the fact that we're winning and that it's get, it gets you through it and looking forward to Saturday, which is the most important game out of all three, really. Yeah, and you feel you're ready to go for Saturday again? I will be, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Got another day yet, so um, no, yeah, I'm looking forward to it, I can't wait. It'd be, it'd be nice to get out on that pitch, you know. Yeah, and no one likes being out injured. I mean, it must be the most frustrating thing ever as a player. Yeah, I'll tell you what. It's so it's you get so many so many low points when you when you're injured, um, and then there's times when you have setbacks and you think you even question whether you come back from from the injury. And um, you know, I don't. I'm I'm not saying I'm 100 percent right now because I'm far from it. But you know, I'll, I'll still give everything I can while I'm while I'm on the pitch. So. Um, you know, if that means another 90 minutes, then it's another 90 minutes. Yeah, must be looking forward to a home game as well. Yeah, just to get out on our pitch, it'd be mm. nice. Um, I've been watched a few games now already, so I uh, thought I was becoming a bit of a fan, let alone a player. <laughs> so, um, yeah, no, I just can't wait, to be honest. Yeah, as you say, it is the most important game, but uh, th those wins, <clears throat> those two cup wins, give you confidence going into this big game. Yeah, without a doubt, and we say it, you say it after the games, you know, you've got to get used to this feeling, get used to the winning feeling again, because, um, like I've said before in an interview, you know, you get you get used to losing, and you get to like the 80 minute mark, and you think, "What well, we're gonna we're gonna concede here," or you know, and, and when you start winning a few games, you get to the 80 minute mark, and you think, well, "We can win this game now," or if you're one nil up, we can hold on definitely. You know, whereas uh, I think in recent weeks and games, we've kind of collapsed. Um, you know, I, I know I've not been a part of that, but like two nil up at Carlisle, and and we lose three two, but you know, maybe now we've uh, we've kind of held on to. To the uh, to the win on Sunday with with nine men, which was you know was massive, mm -hmm. and uh, just shows that we can do it. So you know, take confidence from that. Yeah, and a new dimension to the team with a long throw as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. God, it's been a while since I used that. Shoulders are uh, <laughs> feeling it a bit, but um, no, yeah. It's, uh, if we can get a few goals off that, it'd be great. Um, that's obviously what it's there for. You know, maybe not directly from the throne, yeah. but from a knockdown or. Uh, from anything really, even a couple of own goals off it I've had before. So, um, so yeah, it'd be, it'd be great if we could start getting a few off that. Yeah, and Stevenage not far above you in the table, which makes it that big game that we already alluded to, but to draw them back towards you is a, a double incentive, isn't it? Definitely, draw them back towards us and, and catapult us up the table a bit. Um, I don't know whether it takes us, it puts us level on points with, it, with them or Just with other mind. teams. Um, <laughs> Uh, yeah, but it's it's, it's definitely it's, it's a massive game, so um, you know we, we it's a must win really. Yeah, and their form's not good away from home. Does that put extra pressure on you, or, or is that something you can use to your advantage? Uh, I think it's something you can use to your advantage. Um, at the end of the day, we don't know much about them. They don't know much about us because we obviously haven't played each other yet. But um, we'll get the reports, <laughs> and and at the end of the day, all we can do is give a give our all and. And hopefully the result comes with it after it'd be a great week if it does. Yeah, and obviously the, the cup wins. Does they do they feel that they've maybe given you that sort of light if you like that you know you have turned the corner now and you have to just transform that into the league. Yeah, definitely. Um, it's been a long week because you know traveling. Uh, so, uh, sorry, Saturday night, Tuesday day it was a very long day. Tuesday and uh, playing on that pitch last Sunday didn't help because it takes a lot of takes a lot out of you. Uh, Almost like playing on concrete that pitch was, um, but you know we've we've uh, we've had yesterday off and we've had a recovery day today, so you know there's no excuses not to uh, start the game nice and sharp and you know put them on the back foot. Yeah, wish you the best of luck. Thank you very yeah, much. Yeah, thanks. Thank Cheers. We spoke before about yeah. like your sort of versatility and uh, you know probably been more recognised as a defender in the past couple of years, but you played both games central midfield. Yeah. You know, is that somewhere you, you enjoy playing? Yeah, I like playing there. Um, usually I've got. The legs and the energy to, to get up and down, up and down all day long. It's quite frustrating because you know 
my mind's like wants to shut shut everything down, you know, a bit like Wes. Wes is like a he's like a little rat at times, you know. <laughs> he pretty much, you know, gets gets here, there, and everywhere. And that's what I want to do. But sometimes I just got to remember that, you know, the legs at the moment might not be able to do all of that, but I'll still try and do what I can. Do you know. And there's plenty of competition in that area. You know, there are injuries, but there's a lot of guys that play in that central midfield yeah, yeah. now. Is that is that good for you, or is that brilliant? Yeah, you? that's that's what you need. You need you need the competition because. You know, when there's injuries and you've got players um, playing every game, and, and and they might not think it, but subconsciously they're thinking, well, even if I don't play well today, I'm still going to play the next game. But then when there's three or four or five of you pushing for them same positions, you push each other in training, you push each other on a match day to uh, to to obviously want to do well and and be in that team for the next week because no one wants to be sitting on the bench and, and running after a game um, while the lads are either celebrating in the change room after. You know, it's. it's no one wants that, so um, so yeah, definitely healthy. And I guess you know, having played in a de- as a defender as well, you can play as a defender. You've got that defensive element that make you know sets you apart from the other central midfielders because you can always help back when the other team got the ball. Yes, yeah, see, uh, like for set pieces, example, for example, um, when it when it falls out, I'll always pretty much run back into the centre centre back slot or the right back wherever there's like a gap. It's just it's an instinct really because I'm used to to kind of doing that. Um, so yeah, I suppose you might not see me uh, in the box for cro- for crosses going in, but um, I'll be on the edge and, and hopefully I can get my fair share from there. So yeah.